feel like there's honestly nothing better than a nice cold diet coke in the morning absolutely nothing better except for maybe the fact that now i'm an official law student because today is my first day of law school <laughs> So today is my first day of law school. I feel like a lot has happened since I initially started recording, orientation and things like that. So I'm gonna give you a little life recap while I make breakfast and my lunch for today. And that's gonna be the vlog and yeah. So we're gonna do some stuff. So if you're new, hi, I'm Summer. I am 20 and I am starting my first year in law school. The first day is today. I am going to Elon Law, which is located in Greensboro, North Carolina, and I graduated from Elon University this past May. Yeah, I moved to Greensboro two months ago and have been taking law classes at the law school for three weeks now. This will be my fourth week of classes. And the first three weeks, well, the first week was orientation. And then the last two weeks have been classes that pretty much help you prepare for law school. So they teach you how to brief cases. They teach you how to read a law textbook. They teach you important language that you should know in law school and things like that. So that's what I've been doing for the past two, three weeks. And honestly, I had to do some homework to prepare for my classes this week, and the difficulty level was nothing compared to what I had done in the past two weeks. So I feel super prepared. I'm not really that nervous. So, I mean, I feel like the courses did its job then, right? It's a little weird. I haven't cooked in my apartment yet this week. I was on main campus visiting a couple of my friends because they have all moved in and started their classes last week. So, oh, what the heck? So disappointing. So I went and visited them, which was very, very fun. Enjoyed that. And I hope to go back there often, but anyways. Yeah. So today is my first day of law school. I. Don't want to say I have the best schedule because I think I do, but I'm not going to jinx it. I Today I have Torts and Civil Procedure, which will be Monday, Wednesday, Fridays, which I know is awful. If you don't know, those are the two doctrinal courses and those are the two that are known to be the most difficult, especially your first year. And to have them both on the same day is very... I guess heavy is the word. I don't really know. I don't know. I haven't taken these courses, but that's what I've heard about them. Um, and when one of my summer professors heard that our cohort had those two classes on the same day, she looked concerned. I guess we'll see how that goes. I'm not too worried about it. I mean, I think this week is only going to be really heavy homework amount because it is the very first week. So, I mean, I'm prepared. We'll figure it out. It is currently almost 8 o'clock, and I want to be at the law school by 8.30. Is that going to happen? Probably not. That's my goal, though. <sighs> because although I have a parking pass, I've heard that if, if you get there late, you will have to park on the seventh floor, and I really don't want to do that because the elevators don't always work in this parking deck. I've been towards the civil procedure. I have legal methods, intro to legal studies, and legal research. Those classes will mostly only be on Tuesdays. I only have one class on Thursdays, which is awesome because I think Thursdays is when I'm going to try and get most of my stuff for the next week done. So yeah. Yeah. Anyways, I just finished making my egg. I'm going to finish up my lunch really quick. I've gotten a little lazy with making my lunches recently, where I literally just throw things into a container and pray that I'm going to eat it. And I don't know why I do that to myself, but I really just... Laziness. So, I'm just... I had some old romaine that I cut up, so I'm just going to have some leftover romaine and... Um, Parmesan cheese, I'm gonna add a little side of salami and pepperoni. 
And then I might add some crackers because I feel like if I'm nervous, I probably won't eat. And a little cup of ranch, of course. You have to have ranch in your salad. This is my outfit for the day. I'm gonna wear my black and white Nikes. I'm just gonna eat breakfast here and talk to you. I'm pretty much over like dressing up for law school at this point because it is freezing in that building. And no matter what I wear, I'm always gonna have to wear a hoodie over it. So I'm literally just gonna wear a jacket over this because it's freezing in that building, which is good. I don't want it to be hot, but let's see. Let's do things I'm most excited for and things I'm most nervous for. This is so weird. Law school is literally like high school on so many levels. I'm really scared to eat lunch with the two L's and three L's. Elon's comments where we normally eat lunch is super duper small. And when it was just all of the one L's there, it was crowded. Like it was hard to find a spot. And I would normally eat in a classroom and do homework. Let me just say, when the two L's and three L's are there, I don't know what the heck I'm going to do. Another thing I'm nervous for is my one of my professors um i've heard is very very strict and i am a little nervous for that i don't know what like very hard very i don't know how to describe it because it's she's not mean she's just does that make sense i have that professor today so i'll tell you how that goes after but i'm a little nervous about that i'm also a little nervous because it's no technology in a lot of my classes all right, things I'm most excited for. Let's get to the positive. I am super duper excited to actually start my classes and learn the information. I really want to learn about this stuff and I feel like this is one of the first times when I'm like, oh, like I want to want to know. So that's a really big positive. I feel like that's the biggest one. I don't think there's really another thing that I'm like super excited for. I mean, like I know that sounds probably bad, but I'm just ready to get started. All right, so that was breakfast and making my lunch, and now I am going to put on my sweatshirt, I'm gonna put on my shoes, and I'm gonna leave. Okay, I wanted to go ahead and show you a little bit of what I'm taking today. As you saw, I'm already gonna take that lunch box, and it doesn't fit in my backpack, so I'm just gonna carry that, and then this is my backpack. I have a binder in here, but I don't know how I got it to fit in there, so we'll figure that out. And then these are all the textbooks I'm taking today for classes that I'm required to bring that I don't know how I'm getting them there. But they have to come with me today somehow. I honestly have no idea how I'm supposed to get those textbooks there. I guess I'm gonna have to take a third bag. I really don't wanna be carrying three bags on my way to law school. I feel like that's really weird. So I gotta figure that out, but that's what we gotta bring. Also, so I just got done calling my mom cause I was having a little problem which I'll show you in a minute. This is to anybody who feels stupid on their first day because they have to carry so much stuff. You're not alone. I'm right there with you. I feel stupid too. So, now I'm going to law school. I feel like an idiot. Goodbye. Anyways, I am in the parking deck. I have to say the two L's and three L's were absolutely right. The parking deck is packed. I am here two hours early for my class, almost three hours early. It's 8.19 and my class is at 10.45. You do the math, doesn't matter. And there is like line after line after line of cars when I was coming in, crazy. When I was here literally three days ago, nobody was in here, absolutely insane. So this is gonna be interesting for the rest of the semester. I definitely need to start getting here earlier, but I'm glad I definitely did not get here late. I'm interested to see what the comments looks like because I really do wanna sit down and do some work before Things get started. So I need to do that. I'm gonna go ahead and go in. All right, first day officially of law school done. Um, it is currently 5.38. I got here at 8.30 this morning. You do the math, I don't know how long I've been here. I really need to go to the pharmacy, but I am just like wiped and I still have more schoolwork to do. Um, I am going to go home, work out, shower, chill out, and then I'll continue vlogging when I like make dinner and stuff and we'll 
discuss the day. All right, so I am back from school. I'm back home right now. I am currently making a scrambled egg, kind of. Ooh, well, now it's gonna be scrambled. Whoops, that did not go like I wanted to. All right, I'm back. I am back home. I am done with class. I have worked out, I have showered, I started laundry. I am currently making dinner. We are calling dinner whatever the F I want. We are having some leftover noodles, uh, avocado that wasn't rotten, a scrambled egg on top with some broccoli because I'm eating whatever the F I want because I forgot to thaw some meat. So tomorrow I will meal prep for the rest of the week because this is all I have. And you know what? I'm low key okay with it because it kind of sounds good actually, which is kind of a weird thing to think sounds good, but. So, little recap of the day. Talk about it a little bit. I got to school around 8.30 and my first class was at 10.45. So, got there a little early. I'm gonna be so honest with you. I got there early so that I could do work. I honestly didn't do anything, so I know tomorrow not to go in so early. However, tomorrow's class is at nine, so. I guess I will be going in early. We're adding sriracha mayonnaise to this, of course. You know me. So I got there about nine. I honestly didn't do anything. I tried to look productive, but I was honestly super nervous. And there were a couple of two L's and three L's there. And I felt like I didn't, I don't know. I just, I wasn't feeling myself yet. I wasn't feeling confident. And so I kind of just sat there and acclimated myself, which I feel like was a good thing for me to do. I feel like I needed to do that. Um, and then a couple of people from my cohort came and I spoke to them and we kind of just, I feel like we just diffused the tension and everything. I do have to say this morning I was really nervous because I had three bags, which I felt like was ridiculous to have that many bags. And it was not. Some people had two backpacks. Like, there was a 3L, I'm assuming, and he had on like a backpack normally and then a backpack on the front. So I definitely was not wearing too much. Today was also gonna be my most heavy textbook day because I had all of my case books and they wanted us to bring them all. So, oh my gosh. Can we talk about how big this piece of broccoli is? Well, I guess that's all the broccoli I really need. No, don't fall out. I need a bigger bowl. Ah! Okay, so then we had torts. It was fine. If you don't know what torts is, it's pretty much personal injury and you get to read a bunch of I don't want to say fun cases because people like actually get hurt in these cases, but they're more interesting to read cases, in my opinion, personally, and I think in a lot of people's opinion. So that was fun. Um, no cold calls today because he didn't have his list or whatever. Went to lunch in the commons where we eat lunch, which over the August term, I took classes and it was only one else and it was pretty calm, a uh, like, pretty crowded with 170 of us in there. I'm just saying with over 500 of us in there, it was packed. It was like ridiculous almost. So that was a little nerve wracking. Me and a couple of my friends found this little like a couple of seats like in a corner where we didn't sit before, but that's where we sat and it was fine. Then we went into civil procedure. I had heard that civil procedure was really scary, really nerve wracking. And it was, oh, it 100% was, but definitely felt good about that class. It's definitely very rule heavy, if you don't know that, found that out. So I feel like I'm definitely gonna spend a lot of time in that class memorizing and studying because I feel like it's just gonna be more difficult than a lot of the other classes. Actually, I know it's going to be because I've met other law students who say that. Got done with that class. In that class, we did get cold called on and we were assigned random groups. And I did meet some people in my cohort who I hadn't met before, so that was interesting. That was good to meet them. And yeah, and then after that class, me and two of my friends stayed behind and we just worked on some cases, studied a little bit. Nothing really interesting happened. Um, then I drove home and now I'm here. I do have to say overall, not that bad of a day. I have to say though, being around the other 2Ls and 3Ls is super, almost intimidating because I feel like I look stupid when I'm around them. So, and I, you like hear all these lectures on imposter syndrome and things like that. That's so real when you're in law school. Like I literally 
was working this morning working this morning and I walked in there and there was maybe like five other 2Ls and 3Ls in there and I was like I look like an idiot like I don't like they know I'm not working they know I'm not sitting they know I don't know what I'm doing like I don't know why you're like so in your head about it it's like crazy and I was like Summer you're literally being crazy and I knew I was and I still did it anyways anyways I've almost finished everything for tomorrow I have about 40 pages left to read for intro to legal studies and then I'm going to get started on stuff for Wednesday. I'm going to eat and watch TV and then get started on that and talk to you a little bit. Alright, I finished eating dinner and I'm about to get started on some homework but I wanted to do a little in-depth talk kind of about how I'm studying and what I'm going to be doing because I feel like literally showing you me studying is super boring and that's what I'm going to be doing for an hour and maybe in future vlogs I'll have like a studying vlog. Pretty much what I'm going to be doing is reading this book for my intro to legal studies class and I'm sorry if it sounds like I'm screaming but it is so loud. I have my washing machine going and my neighbor is being super freaking loud right now. So I apologize but all I am doing is I'm going to be reading about 40 pages of this. I have to read pages 11 through 59 and retabbing my book. Anyways, yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and read my book. Um, I do plan on continuing vlogging throughout law school and keeping up and stuff like this. So to say today was really, really difficult to vlog. I'm gonna try and vlog tomorrow because I do have more classes, but I'm not allowed to vlog in class. In a lot of my classes, I can't even have my phone on the desk. No recording to the teachers or the PowerPoints or the presentations or the content or anything like that. Anyways, that is the end of this video. Thank you so much for watching. This is like my first real official law school video because this is my first like real official day. So super duper exciting. I'm really excited to just get started with this next part. I mean, I don't know what else to really say. It's pretty crazy that I'm here right now and I can't wait for y'all to see how this all goes. Why is my knee like that? Anyways, that is the end of the vlog. Thank you so much for watching and make sure to look back at my last video of my apartment tour and my orientation video and things like that if you want to see more law school content and I will see you next time. Bye! Get this ball rolling. Get the day started. So, I'll see you in law school.